Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I am going to be bringing you some cleaning motivation as well as some decorating inspiration. So I hope you guys all enjoy this video and be sure to subscribe if you are new here. I would love to have you and let's just go ahead and get right into this video. You glue all the pieces back together yeah, you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah, you, you're making me want to try forever I feel so free, oh my sweet baby So in today's video, I'm going to be cleaning up here in the kitchen and I want to add a little bit of Valentine's decor in here. I also picked up a few new things when I was at the store the other day. They aren't necessarily Valentine's related, but um, most of the items that I picked up are. I will show you a mini haul halfway through the video and I plan on decorating my little hot cocoa coffee bar area. I'm going to decorate that for Valentine's Day. I'm going to show you exactly how I do that. I will also be decorating my hutch that sits right off of the kitchen table. I'm going to decorate that for Valentine's Day as well. But right now I am just getting in here and putting all of the dishes away that were in the dishwasher and then I'm going to load it back up and then I'm going to show you how I have been cleaning out my sink lately and it comes out looking beautiful and sparkling clean thinking out loud we won't need nothing else for the rest of our time and i know it so well i will always be by your side so the dishes that i'm going to hand wash is actually just one today it is the blender and i use this thing every single day and for that i will be using the mrs meyer's clean day dish soap this is in the honeysuckle scent it is definitely one of my favorite favorite scents i can't wait to find the rose scented mrs meyer's dish soap i have not yet been able to find that in stores i did order some for my giveaway but that won't be mine. It will be going to one of you guys. So if you have not yet entered, go ahead and click on my Q&A and find out how to enter because the giveaway will be ending the end of today, which is Tuesday when this video will go up. And right here, I am just finishing up cleaning out my sink and I like to use the soft scrub cleanser as well as some Dawn dish soap. Be So now I'm just going to be dropping down one of these little lemon scented planks down in here and this is what they look like. They're just these little round balls and you just um, turn your water on really low and then you turn your garbage disposal on and then you drop that down and you let it run for a few seconds and it smells so good. It smells like lemon and it just really cleans and deodorizes your um, disposal. So right here I am bleaching my sink and I'm going to show you how I do that. I am just... Um, Filling my sink up a few inches high just so it completely covers the bottom of my sink and then I'm just going to add about a cup or a half a cup of bleach and I'll let it sit for about 45 minutes. I don't know. I'm going to go through around in my kitchen and just finish cleaning up in here and then when I'm all finished I'm going to drain the sink and I'm going to show you how beautifully white it turns out. The dark. Now you're starting to so now I'm going to be clearing off my countertops because I will be cleaning them and for that I will be using the Mrs. Meyers Clean Day Multi-Surface Cleaner in the Rose Scent. This is their new scent and it smells so, so, so good. It truly smells like fresh roses. They really got this scent down really good. So I love it. It is definitely my favorite for sure right now because you guys know how much I love rose scented products or anything. I just love everything that has to do with roses and I love, love, love this. So if you guys see this at your Target, grab some because they, I have noticed that they have sold out so fast in the multi-surface spray. 
I have not yet seen the dish soap. I hope that they do get it in my Target, but I have not yet seen it. But um, yeah, so I'm just gonna be wiping down the counters in here and then I'll be wiping down some of the other things. Like right here, I'm wiping down the canisters that I have a few of my items in, like the flour and the sugar and the oats right here. And if you guys are interested in where I purchased the labels, I will have that listed in my description box because I have already had a few people ask from watching my cozy home tour about the labels. So I will go ahead and leave that in my description box. The test of time The test of time Sing, won't you sing with me Leave everything for me Stay the night Oh, miss your flight Shut the world out Let's hang out Oh, I used to see in colors Now it's gray Till I met you at the concert The other day The whole room lit up with warmth So I have been bleaching out my sink at least once a week or every other week and I love the results. So I have been doing this because even with my soft scrub sometimes it doesn't get up all the stains that are left in the bottom of my sink and this is a porcelain sink and it does for some reason absorb a lot of stains and scratches so when I do this I'm telling you it makes everything sparkling white and it gets rid of those stains and scratches and it looks beautiful and plus it sanitizes it. Now that I have my kitchen clean, I'm going to head on over to this hutch area. I wanted to make it look a little pretty, I guess, for Valentine's Day. I don't have too many items to decorate with as far as Valentine themed, but I'm going to add a couple things in here. And I don't know about you guys, but I don't really decorate too much for Valentine's Day. Let me know in the comments if you guys decorate for Valentine's Day or if you don't at all, or what holidays you love decorating most for. go out You're in my mind I close my eyes So it's just you and I And I tell myself You'll be back again Stars are aligned, we will dance in the meadow on our favorite place when spring. 
spring is coming. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. So once I was finished decorating this hutch here, I was looking at this plate rack that I'm showing you right here and I did purchase that at Hobby Lobby I get tons of questions about that and I kind of wanted to add maybe like some pretty pink dessert plates or um, salad plates you know just like the smaller plates in there and um, I don't know let me know what you guys think I like it kind of plain I don't want it to look too busy in here but it is a hutch and I did want to throw mostly dishes in here but I was thinking about looking at maybe the Dollar Tree to see what they had. So I don't know, go ahead and let me know down in the comments if I should add plates to this plate rack or just leave it. On our favorite plate, when spring is coming. Okay, so before I start decorating my coffee bar slash hot cocoa area, I want to show you the items that I will be using. If you follow me on Instagram, you will have already seen this half of the items. If not, I'm going to go through them really quickly one more time in case you don't follow me there. But I did recently stop by Target and I picked up a few things in the dollar spot and then these mugs here were just over by the rest of the coffee mugs. So I found this tray and I'm gonna use this over in the coffee area and it says, let's do brunch. And these, this was in the dollar spot for $7. And then I got these, um, they're called gift toppers, but I'm gonna use them by my coffee mugs. And they're just um, really pretty florals. I got a white one and a pink one and they were a dollar. And then I picked up these smaller sized coffee mugs. They're clear and they just, ha one of them has a hello love on the bottom and then the other one has hearts. And it came in a set of two and there was, I wanna say about three or four different styles and they were $5 for the pack. And then I got this mug and it says you plus me equals love. And then um, this was $5. And like I said, I got, these mugs over in the regular coffee mug area where they have the dishes and then this one says love is the answer and they were both these two were five dollars a piece and then the set of the two were ten dollars and the, one of them says i love you and the other one says i love you more and i thought they were really cute and then at home goods I purchased these items to go into my coffee area. Well, these two are not, and the napkins back here. But um, I just want to show you everything that I got. So I'm going to use this dispenser here to actually hold this syrup. And you can use this syrup in coffee, and you can add a little bit to your hot chocolate, and it tastes really good. So this was $12.99, and the syrup was $3.99. And then I just got some toppers, like if you want to add a little bit of sprinkles to your hot cocoa or whatever, I just thought it was cute to add those in there. And these were all $2.99 a piece. And then over here, I thought it would be cute to add some marshmallows like I did with the Christmas cocoa bar. And these are just heart-shaped marshmallows and I thought they were super cute. And they were $4.99 for the pack. And then for in my kitchen area, not by the coffee bar, I just want to quickly show you these really pretty hand towels. This one says love and it has like the florals on there. I thought that was so pretty and it came with two of them. And then this one is just like an everyday type towel. It's not necessarily Valentine's Day, but I loved the print. I thought it was really pretty. And both of them were $6.99 and they came with a set of two. And then also for my cocoa bar coffee area I got these coffee cups and they're so adorable they have the little hearts on them and then the little um cozy thing or whatever that is 
It just says, I love you, a latte, and they were $4.99 for the pack. And then I also picked up these super cute napkins. It's just like a um, gingham type pattern with some hearts on there, and those were $6.99. And then I got this cute tin, breakfast served daily, and I am going to replace that with this and I just thought it would look super cute in here so that's all that I got and now I'm gonna start decorating the coffee area So here is my Valentine's Day themed hot cocoa slash coffee bar area and I think it turned out super adorable. I absolutely love it. This is pretty much the only area of my house that's really decked out in Valentine's decor and I love it. I think it's super pretty and right here in this cookie jar here, this chicken that you see, that's where I store all of my hot cocoa. That way it's put away really neatly and I think the chicken looks really cute sitting there. And I did paint that, that used to be green. And as for the jade mugs, I did replace those with some mugs that matched a little bit better. I think I had some white ones with florals on there and I just ended up replacing those and I thought it looked better, but here it is and I am so happy with it. So the last thing that I'm going to do in here is run the vacuum and I want to tell you a little bit about this vacuum. A company sent this to me. This is not a sponsored video, but a company did send this vacuum to me to try out and give a review on it. 
and I do really, really like it. What I like most about this vacuum, and I it might sound silly, but it's the light. This vacuum has a light on it, and it is amazing what you can see. I love it. The run time is way longer than a Dyson. I think the run time is like 20 minutes. I'm not sure exactly. I'll have to go check on that for you. But um, I really like this vacuum. I did notice that the suction isn't as great as the Dyson. It did pick up everything that I ran over. I think it works best on like hardwood floors, carpets maybe not so much. But I've also noticed that with my Dyson, the carpets, it doesn't pick up as much as a regular corded vacuum. So I'm just going to run the vacuum really quick and then I will be mopping my floors. I'm going to be using my O-Cedar mop and bucket. Love this. It makes mopping a breeze. And what I am using to mop my floors with is just a little bit of dish soap and some doTERRA on guard essential oils. And it smells so, so, so good. And that is what I'm using today. And I am just making sure that the water is super, super, super hot. Well, that is it for today's video. I hope it brought you some cleaning motivation as well as a little bit of decorating inspiration. And if you enjoyed this video, I would love it if you left me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new and I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. See you in the next one. Bye.